feel something pecking at it. There he goes. There he goes. What you want to do, you want to pull the heads off of them. <laughs> Seems to be working. So we did a show in Almorada with Tony De Los Santos and these snook and trout we were catching this little tiny canal would not eat the pilchards unless the heads were off of them. Really? Would not eat them. <laughs> Captain Tony's secret is to get rid of the head. He said it's the only place he's, you know, comes around and fishes dead bait because of the, uh, because of the fish here, so. Pop the head off. I started biting the heads off of them and catching fish. <laughs> yeah, you know, sometimes you just gotta mix it up a little. Like that. There he is. Like that one. Oh, and the circle hook did the job, baby. For now. <laughs> that could be a grown one there. A little bit of pull on him. Got those shorter bounces to it. Looks like a snapper. It is digging, that's for sure. For sure. Hey, well, thanks for tuning into this segment right here, guys. Only you guys are being able to see this tonight on the internet only. This ain't gonna be airing on the TV, so you guys are getting a special treat. We're out on the Starbright boat. We got Captain Greg Dornow up there, his son Gregor, and uh, we are catching some fish in the middle of the Gulf of Mexico. Ugh. Uh, if y'all don't know anything about Starbright, if you happen to use a, a product out there called Startron, it'll save your engine and make it run a whole lot better. That's the same company. There he is. That is a nice one. That is a heck of a mutton. Mm. Got to fight all the way to the boat. That's amazing how they give up right when they get up top. Ugh. That'll work. And that's what you get when you come to Key West. And that is a trocar circle hook that did the job right there. Right where it's supposed to be. But uh, thanks to the Starbright boys for putting us on these fish and Captain Chris Trossett as well. He's the, uh, he's the local captain down here and he will flat put you on these if you come catch them. So thanks for tuning in to this little segment on the YouTube Live. Hey, and hopefully my hair won't be messed up when I get right back. We'll see you in a second.